and welcome. My name is Calliope, and I'm going to be performing your hearing examination today. How are you doing today? Okay. I hope by the time you leave my office, you feel even just the littlest bit better. So let's get started. I'm going to ask you just a couple of questions before we begin. Firstly, would you mind just confirming your name and date of birth for me? Okay. Good. And is that your preferred name and how do you like to be addressed? Very good. Excellent. So tell me a little bit about why I'm seeing you today for this hearing examination. Okay, and are you finding that the difficulty in hearing is more on one side, the other, or is it bilateral? Okay, good to know. And do you happen to notice if you have more trouble, say, hearing higher frequencies, like more feminine voices or children, or do you have more troubles with lower frequencies, like more masculine voices? Okay, that's fine. We can test that today. And have you noticed if you're having more trouble when there is background noise, whether it is some people around a radio, television, does that make it much harder? Okay, so that's just a couple of questions and the rest we can ascertain with our test. So firstly, I am going to take a look at your ears to make sure there aren't any contraindications to us doing this test. I'm going to sanitize my hands real quick. And for the purposes of this examination, I will need to be touching you. Is that okay with you? Do I have your permission to do that? Very good. Excellent. So I'm going to take a look at the external ear, firstly. So I think... Da, 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 da. I'll start with this one. Okay. So I am going to just come around to the side. of the ear. Looks healthy. Skin's a good color. I'm just going to fold your ear back and I'm going to take a look at the back of the ear. I'm just going to fold this over and take a look behind the ear. Okay. So we look back here because it's extremely difficult for us to normally do it for ourselves. This is where we can find some lesions, possibly, or other skin abnormalities. But this looks good. I'm just going to put your ear back. 
Okay, so let's go ahead and take a look at the other ear. health as well as the skin good elasticity let's take a look behind the ear so I'm just going to pull the ear back and then we can take a peek behind the ear here just make sure there's nothing along the root of the ear here there's nothing along the mastoid process. Nothing down below or right above along the hairline here. Okay, let's go ahead and put that back. Okay, I'm going to do a little bit of bilateral palpation. Do let me know if there is any pain or tenderness. Any pain? Any uncomfortable sensations? No? Okay. Okay, so I am going to pop the speculum on my otoscope and we're going to take a peek inside the ear. So let me just grab my speculum and we're going to pop this brand new one right on the otoscope. And we are going to take a look inside the ear. So I'm going to be pulling your ear up and back and then just very gently inserting the otoscope into the ear canal. And then I can take a little peek into the ear, see if there's anything we can spot out of the ordinary like a cerumen blockage or any signs of perforation on the tympanic membrane, infection in the ear, things of that nature. I'm going to be very careful, right? I would like to ask you to stay as still as possible. I do brace myself on your head so that I don't poke you, but just want you to be aware there. to the ear canal. Good. Okay. So do you happen to work in a loud environment or do you live near a loud environment? For example, let's say a lot of construction or maybe a very high traffic area. Okay. And do you frequent loud events like concerts at all? Okay, do you operate machinery like lawnmowers or other heavy equipment without any hearing protection? Okay. So this ear canal looks clear. I'm not seeing any signs of a cerumen blockage, which is good. Okay, and the tympanic membrane looks to be in good health as well. I'm going to gently pull the otoscope out of the ear canal and put your ear back. And then we're going to take a peek at the other side. Gently insert the otoscope into the ear canal. Good. Very good. Okay, so just taking a little peek here. 
and the skin inside the ear canal, the external auditory medius, looks to be clear. I'm not seeing any redness. It's not even really pink. Good hair distribution. There's no overproduction of cerumen. translucence there. Okay, so I got my little check mark, check mark boxes all ticked off. <laughs> I'm gonna pull the otoscope out, put the ear back, and flip off the otoscope. So I think your ears are in good health and we can proceed with our assessment. So, for this hearing examination, we are going to primarily be doing a test known as audiometry. In audiometry, you may know as the beep test. If you've ever gotten your hearing tested before, you put on the big headphones and you hear beeps in one ear or the other, sometimes both. And I want you to either vocalize, say yes, or something along that lines, or you can raise your hand on the side you hear the noise. If it's in the middle, you can hold up both hands. So I am going to be placing the headphones on your head and then we are going to proceed with the audiometry exam, okay? All right, so let's pop these bad boys on. These are the headphones we'll be using. They are Bluetooth, so we don't have to mess with any wires. and we will proceed with the exam. So let me just get this adjusted. I think, I think that'll be a good fit. So I am going to ask you to just remain still while I pop these on your ears, okay? Good. Excellent. How does that feel for you? Is there any pinching at all? Do you feel like it's too tight? Is it too loose? Okay. Okay. Very good. Do let me know if we need to adjust the fit. Okay? It's comfortable in your ears too? Okay, good. So give me just a moment. And then we are going to proceed with the test. Okay. So I'm going to grab my little clicker. And we are going to begin. Ready?
It feels a little nerve-wracking, I know, you're a little bit on the spot, but don't worry, you are doing excellent, okay? If you need to stop, just let me know, alright? Okay, are you ready to move on to the next part? Very good, let's go ahead and proceed. Take a break. All good? Okay. to the next one.
very good. So give me just a moment. started on the next section. doing really well. And now for the next section, we are only going to be testing your left side, okay? Just the left. Thank you. 
There's going to be some background noise, okay? Start 
finish on that. So I'm going to put this on. There's going to be some background noise. And then again, just tell me what side you hear the noise on or raise your hands, okay? section.
section. This will be the last section for the background noise. section of the test, we are going to do only high frequencies and only low frequencies, okay? And after that, we'll take off your headphones and we'll get you all squared up, okay? the low frequencies.
that looks excellent. Allow me to just take the headphones off of your ear. Okay, stay still. There we go. How was that? Yeah, it's not too bad. Lots of people find it actually quite relaxing. So before we go over your results, do you have any questions for me at all? Yes, my head was bobbing quite a bit. <laughs> So, when we are doing the test, we are doing about a count of three between each beep. So, to keep myself on task, to keep myself on track, rather, I count in my head a little bit. Sometimes my head moves, so that lets me know if perhaps you've missed a sound, if the timing isn't quite correct. Let's take a look at your results. So for the most part, it looks pretty normal. You did have a little bit of trouble with the high frequencies. Just go about there. And you did have some issues with the background noise. So those are our main areas of concern. But overall, you got most of the beeps, which is good. It's just some of those high frequency ones and then in the background noise section, okay? All right, so at this time, I think we'll keep an eye on on your hearing. We may have you back here pretty soon, get that looked at again, but otherwise, I think you are doing, you're doing pretty okay. So do you have any questions about your results? Okay. All right, let me just go ahead and sign off on this. Okay. And that will end our hearing examination. Thank you so much for coming to see me to have your audiometry exam. I really hope that you enjoyed it. I hope you have a whale of a day and a good rest of your night. Thank you. Pseudoscience and personal attention.